waves transfer from one place to another and hence cover a distance in a specific amount of time t with a specific velocity. The velocity of a wave is defined by velocity v and equals to distance d divided by time. As mentioned, the velocity of a wave is the distance it travels divided by time. However, the distance covered by a wave is measured in wavelength, which is the distance between two consecutive crests or troughs known as lambda. So, the distance covered by the wave will be equal to one wavelength lambda divided by time t. If we recall the previous topics, frequency of a wave is defined as 1 upon time period. So, we can rearrange the equation of velocity as v equals to lambda multiplied by 1 upon t. So, we replace t by frequency and the formula for velocity becomes v equals to frequency f multiplied by wavelength lambda. This equation is true for both types of waves, that is the transverse and longitudinal waves. Now, it's practice time. We are going to solve a numerical with the help of the knowledge and the formulae that we have learned so far. So, the problem says that a wave moves on a slinky spring with a frequency of 4 hertz and a wavelength of 0.4 meters. We have to find the speed or velocity of the wave. The formula we have is velocity v equals to frequency f multiplied by lambda. By inserting the values into the formula, we get v equals to 4 hertz multiplied by 0.4 meters, which gives us the answer velocity equals to 1.6 meters per second.